Okay, hello all. Welcome to The Walking Dead again. Um, we're not streaming, obviously. We're doing a regular uh, one. It's actually midnight. I'm going to be recording this until uh, I get tired enough to where I need to go to bed, which is not going to be long, sadly. Oof. But I am doing it because I love you guys, obviously. Uh, we're in episode two. We're on this farm, doing whatever. Last time, uh, a recorded part came up. Uh, I was streaming, and Ollie and House Julia I happened to pop in and say hi. Uh, I that stream was actually the second highest stream I had out of all of my streams so far. My highest stream was 15. And my second highest is 9, so obviously I'd love it to go higher, but a lot of you guys actually don't know I have a Twitch. So uh, soon enough, before I do streams, I'll post a video saying, hey, I'm live streaming. Uh, and do a little like quick preview vid of what I'm doing, of how stupid it is. <sighs> Yawns. Anyways, so kind of left off, you know, in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. But here we go. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? What? Oh, geez, you were a madman back there. Took that crazy bitch down. Yeah. You're back! What happened? Lee took care of it. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. Really? Calm down. Lily's pain. What's going on with them? Dunno. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Don't mind them, it's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all get a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. Think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. Thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. I bet. Alright, anyways, I'm gonna be pretty quiet because I need to conserve a lot of energy. That's why I would like to not do that. <sighs> oh, there's Clementine. Hi. Rape. <laughs> Something like the terms. Hmm. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> hey there, Andy. Yeah? How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. We 
We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Thanks. Yep. found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? True, true. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, the guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. Mm. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor, what you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Okay, cool. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No, why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, yeah. you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> what? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Kenny thought he heard a noise. He's a little jumpy, huh? Well, we're all sure glad his wife is here. She's a lifesaver. You, you got no idea. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Uh-oh. All right, I know what to do. I know there's, like, some kind of... wrench of some sorts. Look around. It's gotta be something I can use. I know there's something where uh, I can get that lock up. It's like a multi tool of some sort. It's like sitting around here somewhere. Sadly, I forgot where it was. Because I'm more used to episode 3 and 4. Like, I'm not big on episode 5. like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. It smells pretty foul. Not like, ugh. It's the blue store. Alright. So I'm gonna leave the barn. And I know how to distract them, so we're not gonna do that just yet. I've got an idea. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them.
Just gonna to borrow this for a second. Go talk to Larry, I guess. Oh, I still got my axe. That's interesting. Axe, the MP3 camera. We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. You been getting along with Larry? <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. That's nice. Cool. How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. So, what are y'all keeping the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. Sure. Think I'll go have a look around. Kinda peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll yeah. probably start hearing those monsters find Yeah, sorry, I'm like really like long. into the game at the moment. I sadly know how to do this real quick, so we can get this done and over with very fast. Guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. There we go. There we go. Ow! Damn it! Thing is moving fast. Ow, damn it. Thing is moving fast. <laughs> there we go, turn it off. There, that should do it. Huh. Fucking Danny, where'd he find this piece of shit? Ow, oh, fucking thing threw a bell. Damn it, dog. Ah, oh, son of a fuck! Oh, this take forever. <laughs> Alright. So it looks like we finally pissed off the neighbors, as we would say. Got a little bit to go through. And we gotta open this door. Oh, I'd be curious, what? I remember. <sighs> I would be very, very curious. There's a baby in there? Careful, don't spook her. <laughs> hey, Clementine. My hat! You found it! I knew I'll you'd find you it. Back. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? I'd like to someday. All Maybe right, a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow right. with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Alright. I picked up something I think could help with the lock. Nothing to stop you now. Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on!
on, let's eat. Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. do this but we kind of have to it's kind of part of the game kind of remember some of the stuff that's going to happen in a little bit but don't really want to you know remember it all Dinner time. Look, I just came in and found the door open like that. Probably my idiot brother. Uh, hey, was anyone with you just now? No. Not the doc? No, she went in the house. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, good. That's not good. That's not good at all. <laughs> oh, I don't like that you are an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. True. True, true, true. Forgot this part. Oh, 
Clementine! No! Huh? Huh? Stop. There we go. Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Are you uh, scaring the kids, Lee? Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Oh, here we go. Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Quiet. What is going on? They're picking us off to trade us You're meat. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs. Oh, Britta, Jesus. tell me he's not being eaten right now. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? Okay. To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better. Just let us go. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Lily, grab a knife! Nobody's going anywhere! Oh, we got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put your fuck? guns down! We're walking out of here! Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. <gasps> Lee? Lee? <gasps> you fucker! I'll tear you apart! Did God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet, come on, Dad. Now's not the time. Is there a way out? Yeah, through this fucking door. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches. They locked us in here. I think it's a meat locker. Those psychos have caught you and duck. Open up, you sons of bitches! Dad, please stop. This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. Ooh, it's gonna nice be okay. Opinion. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're, you're worse than the walker. Right Dad, there. please. Hmm. Please settle down. I'll, I'll, I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get. Uh, 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 easy. Uh, Breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel. How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. 
but in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! Jesus. We can bring him back, Lee. Good okay. morning, later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He is not dead. All right. Lily can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Oh, Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not going to make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee! I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. I... Come on. You're right, Kitty. Let's get you this over. You fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't want to see. Thank you. Sorry, Lily. No, no, no! It's the only way. <laughs> get off me! Don't do this! No! No, no, no! Let go of me! No, please. Come on. No! 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 At least it wasn't horrendous. Oh God. God help us. I'm sorry. I Don't know you it. fucking touch me! Clementine. Clem, you okay? Why, Lee? Lily said he wasn't dead. He, he was dead, Clementine. But what if he wasn't? He was, I, I promise. Poor Clem. I, I know. I shouldn't but have you gotta be decision. strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? How about you walk talkie? Talk. Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. There ought to be an air duct really behind this unit. Really Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Cents. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm -mm. Not coming off that way. Got this. Get away. I just need to. I told you to get the fuck away. Jesus Christ, Lily. Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. Larry would have wanted- Fuck you! You think he wanted this? Of course not. You but... don't know what he wanted. You never knew him. You never gave him a chance. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe I should have tried hard. But I know he loved you. He'd want you to get out of here. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your... Permission. 
Do what you have to do. Jesus. I don't like this, but... Oh, boy. Oh, we really have no choice. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Nope. You fucking vulture! his wallet. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. Hmm. Sixty cents. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. Off that way. You got it? Yeah. One more should do it. Alright. We got this, guys. We got this. Well, there's our way out, Lee. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. I'm making some harsh decisions, but... I know you're brave enough. We have to. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. Stay here. Right. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Let's do this. I'm gonna get gun pointed to the face most likely, but let's try it. Slaughterhouse. Yeah, no kidding. Alright, so we're gonna end this episode here.